Joseph Dames is here now. Joseph, spring break for a lot of people. And today was actually a really nice day, but we have some nicer days coming up in the forecast. For yeah, that. we sure do. We have a compliment of some sunshine, some clouds, and a little bit of rain, but that wouldn't be an Oregon spring break or a Washington spring break if we didn't have True. at least a splash of rain out there. All right, let's take us through this uh, time lapse coming out of the Scamania Lodge. I mean, we had some sunshine, the low clouds this morning, and very scattered showers that you'll notice that get some lift from the hills, and it splashes right there, and then we just have sunshine sunshine right across the river. So it's been a little bit of everything for parts of the gorge today, but right now it is looking very comfortable. Low fog, low clouds this morning to start off in Vancouver and across the way here in Portland, but it cleared out. We had nothing but sunshine. Great. You know, maybe riding a bike or just going for a walk or a run weather uh, for this afternoon. Feeling really good on our Sunday. It's been definitely more dry than yesterday where we had uh, just multiple showers pass on through. Right now, the radar isn't very active. We've had a couple small areas of rain uh, passing through to the south near Salem and Lebanon, and this is all tracking to the east, but we're watching a cold front that's going to move in overnight tonight and into tomorrow, and that's going to bring in more rain to start off the work week. We have this ridge of high pressure here, but we have a couple disturbances that are come sliding down like shoots uh, as we go through the first couple days of our new work week. Some Monday showers are in the forecast as this front does start to approach, and then that also means some more snow for the mountains, likely the coast range and into the Cascades. A little bit tonight shouldn't uh, slow things down come tomorrow morning, but just be prepared for some more snowfall for areas like the coast range come tomorrow morning. 24 degrees right now on the mountain. You can see the sunshine reflecting off the snow. It just looks so comfortable up there right now with kind of a gentle wind blowing out of the west. The ski report, well, picking up some nice fresh snow over the last 24 hours. Most of that was well, through the overnight, but uh, about four inches at Timberline, Meadows at four inches, Ski Bowl two, and couple inches at Bachelor, and that's just additional snowfall from the day before the previous 24 hours. So it is just really good up there right now for the mountains. Speaking of snow, I saw this photo and I think this just discusses how hard it is to forecast sometimes. This is actually a photo coming out of Indiana. You can see snow line here, very sharp from no snow to snow. This was sent into me. Uh, that's how difficult it is sometimes to forecast snowfall. Add some mountains, add some hills. It makes it even more difficult, but this view coming up from an airplane. I love this shot. This was sent in from Ruben. If you have any photos, go ahead, send them on and you can reach me at Twitter as well as Facebook on social media. So it's time out that rain come tomorrow morning. It approaches the coast closer to about midnight slides into the valley about four in the morning and I think we'll probably start off our morning with some showers. So if you are planning to get out for your commute tomorrow, be prepared for some rain, especially the coast snowfall for the Washington Cascades. That heavy snowfall is likely going to stay up there in Washington, but we'll get some here too, uh, which will be really nice for the Oregon Cascades. We'll keep rain in the forecast through our Monday afternoon, some dry time off to the east, but you're not off the hook. I expect some snowfall for the higher elevations there towards Pendleton and down towards towards Baker City if you're traveling to pass, uh, if you're doing some traveling for your spring break and you're getting out of the city or you're getting out of Oregon. We got Tuesday morning about 11 a.m. More rain. I think we'll probably pick up about a half an inch of rain as we go through our Monday and then again into our Tuesday for areas of Portland. Spring break forecast starting off the week with a little bit of rain. As I just mentioned and showed, temperatures near 50 degrees, so it's going to be cool. But if you just hang in there, we get to about Wednesday through Saturday. Then we're talking about some nice spring break weather. Temperatures near 60 degrees. Your seven day forecast 49 on Monday, 53 on Tuesday, and then we just have a steady climb all the way to about Easter on Sunday. Temperatures about 60 degrees, Chris. So if you have plans uh, for the start of the week, maybe a little wet. Second part of the week, very nice. Looking forward to the second part of the week and yeah. Easter Sunday, next Sunday. That's perfect weather for the kids. So far, great Easter egg hunting weather. Right. All right. <laughs> Good stuff. All right. Well, thanks for watching Coin Six News. Stay with us. We'll be